20 minutes. Republican presidential candidate Ted Cruz, the Texas senator, has captured the Iowa caucuses, beating businessman Donald Trump 28 to 24 percent. Tonight is a victory for courageous conservatives across Iowa and all across this great nation. In third place with 23 percent was Florida Senator Marco Rubio. The entrance poll showed Mr. Rubio outpaced his rivals by big margins on the question of which candidate Republicans think can win in November. He also built a big edge among caucus goers who want the next president to be experienced. This is a time for a president that will rebuild the U.S. military because the world is a safer and a better place when the United States has the most powerful military in the world. Meanwhile, after leading the race for six months, Mr. Trump's stardom wasn't enough to overcome Mr. Cruz's ground game. Iowa, we love you. We thank you. You're special. We will be back many, many times. In fact, I think I might come here and buy a farm. I love it, okay? Mr. Cruz led the GOP field as the top pick of 28% of Republican caucus goers, again followed by Mr. Trump at 24, Rubio at 23%. Ben Carson finished fourth, followed by Rand Paul, and then Jeb Bush, who got 3%, getting less than 2% each. John Kasich, Chris Christie, Carly Fiorina, and Mike Huckabee. Mr. Huckabee, the former Arkansas governor, promptly dropped out of the race. On the Democratic side, less than a percentage point separated former Secretary of State Hillary Clinton and Vermont Senator Bernie Sanders. It was generally too close to call into the wee hours, but Miss Clinton's camp this morning is claiming victory. With 99% of precincts reporting, she led 49.9% to 49.6% for Mr. Sanders. She addressed her support.